Welcome back. Thank you for joining us. And we're just going to go ahead and get uh, started. Now, let's look for invasion. Well, manageable invasion, I should say. There's one. So let's just go there and let's get these name droppers all taken care of. Hopefully we'll be able to name them all by the end of this. But yeah, I'd say we're making pretty good progress in terms of uh, getting these gags all maxed and such. But yeah, it's all pretty good, I'd say. But, uh, because we're pretty relatively close in terms of the next, uh, throw it squirt. Yeah, not bad. Just about, like, a little under 700 for that. A little over 800 for that, so it's pretty good. But, uh, Now, with sound, that's a little bit of a different story, obviously, so, but we just gotta trade it up a little. Paper editor, I think once we get it up a little bit more, we'll be able to head into the factories and uh, be able to take care of some of those Gates of Disguise parts. But yeah, we're getting there, we're pretty close be able to do that. I'd say like once these two are for sure level 5 right here once this gets a little more would we'll be pretty good at that regard. But yeah, we're doing pretty good I'd say. And overjoy is over, so that's always good. And honestly, it's all just kind of give and take at this point because, you know, we're able to use higher level gags for fighting higher level cogs, but at the same point, yeah, like that. Damages do a lot more. So at this point, it's probably best to run back to the playground here real quick. And let us re well, not necessarily re gag, but uh, get laugh. Now, I'd like DTC where you get nice crew codes to enjoy. We're getting some nice flowers here to enjoy. Everyone loves a good flower. You, you know. You could use flowers in your guard, you could use flour to bake things, flowers just everywhere, you know. Speaking of flowers, I truly rose to the occasion of those last battles there, I would say. But uh Okay, I can't seem to find another flower. Oh, there's a flower. 
All right, let's head back out there. Let's get this next few battles going here. Yeah, I will say, like, the bugle is pretty good in terms of taking out level 3s. Because it is a level 3 gag, obviously. And, uh, it only takes two takes to take out, well, uh, not two takes to take out, the, the two shots to take out a level 3. You know what I was saying. I, you know what, we all know what I'm saying, I just can't say it, you know? Oh, I can't say how well that is. Okay, well, we're just going to move on to the next one here. And, of course, sound missed. That's okay, though, because I got more where that came from. I will say the Aoka does do well to serve its uh, serve its purpose here in this case. Granted, I'm now almost out because one missed before, but that's okay. But look at that, 24 solid XP out of that round alone. That's amazing. was gonna happen. I was holding my breath there. I'm like, please hit. And then I just, I just knew it would, though. But the main thing is we have them down and out for the count now. This time we're definitely gonna have to go regag. out there. I'm gonna drop my name. Well, guess what? I'm gonna drop this sound on ya. Oh. Oh 
Okay, so it looks like this is all we're gonna get out of uh, this invasion. So it looks like we'll just have to look for another. Honestly, though, it's good those that now uh, you can see. I think we're about halfway, a little over halfway to that next sound gag. So that's pretty good. That's good progress. Uh, we are going to have to uh, try to get these two up a little more, though. So let's look for an invasion elsewhere. Wait a minute. Oh gosh, okay, let's go help them real quick. I just saw... Okay, they got it. I got concerned there, but okay. Oh, tight wads. We won't be able to talk, but that's okay. We don't need that function. We got this headpiece for that. There we go. All right. He tried to raid on my parade, but I said no, because I'm just going to keep on going. That's how I roll. Well, technically, that's how I throw, but we're still rolling. And that's the good thing now, because I could use that combo there of these two to take out a level five with throw and squirt so that's just that's just amazing right there being able to do that because it does kind of start to expand the scope of what levels i could take on and gaining that extra xp out of things so it's all pretty awesome And what's a cog battle without a good throw missing, of course? Maybe an Aoo that will settle down a little. Oh, I might need another. Okay. But you know what, though? Ooh. Okay, yeah, let's definitely regag. And get laugh. Think about though that is the advantage of I think trading here too is the fact that like with the flowers you get Ted laugh back. Oh boy. There it comes another. Yeah, we're living a little dangerously, but that's alright. Now, this leads us with a good question. Do we go with a high accuracy or something that might miss? All right, yeah, this is not gonna be good. Oh wait, what? 
Uh, let's let's try it. Uh, there we go. That was a lot of bit dangerously today. All right. Let's uh, let's definitely go back now. No, oh, it's right here. Okay. Oh, that was intense. I mean, we're outdoors, but that was intense. Yeah, I definitely feel good where uh, Squirt is right now, definitely. I mean, only 600 away from the next. That's just... We could theoretically get there in another couple episodes. Then once that's up, and once... Uh, Throw is up to level 5, then we could start really getting into the... Fa I'm really excited for factors, if you haven't noticed. They're like the core of what we're going after here. Because once we, once we get tired of them, then we can get the merits necessary for our first VP, and then we could, well, trade a little more, but then go into the VP and take it on as an Uber. Ideally, you do want to try and have Max or, you know, Gags here before you go in. But, honestly, these two are going to get traded up pretty easy once you reach this to get to here. Uh... This will be relatively easy. It's just about actually uh, putting in the work to do it. So it is time consuming, certainly, but uh, manageable. Definitely manageable. All right, let's get some tight ones. And yeah, give it a good spritz with our seltzer, of course. That's the, uh, there we go. We have buildings falling from the sky. That's never a good thing. Honestly, that is one thing I've noticed is like with this street, there are certainly a lot more level six cogs on it, which will be okay once we reach the level five throw and squirt. But uh, for now, probably best to stay away from that. A lot of my throw gags are very defective. Oh, that was a close one. All right. Oh look, there's one about to join the battle here. This should be good. Uh, yeah, that's certainly one of the uh, disadvantages of uh, Uber trading is uh, you have to run a little bit. Situations get a little dire.
But certainly we're making great progress. It, look at it, you know, not just our gags, obviously, because this is pretty good. But you also got to take a look at the cog gallery, for example. And we already got four kind of at like the max out point that they watch at. We do need significantly more tight watts, which is, I guess, a good thing why we're in this evasion. And for this, we'll give it a good bugle. Wake it up at 0500. That's Mr. Taiwan. Okay, fine. That's Mr. Royal Blue Crocodile to you, sir. Look out blue. You know what, it's funny, you put the anvil on the tight one, well, does it turn it into like a money bag's face or something? That's really interesting. Joy. You know, it's interesting because it's one of those things where you see a lot more of a joining battle here than we did in TTC. And it's interesting because I think it's, I don't know if it's statistically proven, but it's definitely more likely, uh, well, at least it's been empirically likely, I guess I should say, not necessarily statistically, but empirically, that you would run into more, that, like, into battles like these where more cogs would want to join, and this is not good, I thought it would be enough to take them out, but... Such is the life of an Uber. Anyway, though, so I guess while I'm sad walking around, I'll just elaborate a little further on that point where, uh, yeah, it, it is empirically shown that the cogs are more likely to join battle in uh, Daisy Gardens or even in, in East Melody Land than in any other uh, playground. Which is interesting if you think about it. So, there's that potential that you have to put up with it. Unfortunately, I thought that would have been enough to take it out, and, uh... Well, that's okay, because I got my auto flower here as soon as I'll be able to, and then we're just gonna hop on trolley and, uh... try and recoup our gags that way.
Perfect score. All right. Where could he do that again? Oh, perfect. Same type of music to the escape, too. It's interesting how, like, you have some trolleys games that use similar music. Oh, I've been found. Still need a flower. But are wanting to show. Okay, so we'll just head out back out there for a few more battles. Those flowers certainly did not hurt. They, well, they certainly, uh, whatever. I was gonna say they failed to rose to the occasion, but it would be failed to rise. So it's like, well, uh, and the invasion is ended on top of that. Terrific. Okay, so it looks like we're going to have to go elsewhere. Look at the guards, because... Hey, you know, here's something. How do flowers talk, even, with their two lips? Two lips. And there is not a single invasion to be found. So for a few battles here, we're just going to do the old school with uh, no real double XP out of it. So this ought to be good. Basic more of the uh, 
blue face group here with the gold collars. Oh, I was a little too late on that one. Okay. Hell dice. That is really nice of them. To do that, we're just going to keep sounded off on this. I forgot we can't necessarily use chat because we were in a uh, what are they called? Speed chat list district, something like that. I don't, whatever it's called. But speaking of sounding off, I believe we're pretty much have done with this episode. Considering there are no invasions to really go to right now, anyway. Uh, so yeah, I guess to keep the guard team continuing here, it's time to turn up the next page. You know, turn up guard. Uh, anyone? Anyway, but uh, thank you for watching, and hope to see you next time, everyone.